Hey there YouTube, I um, just want to make a quick video of a special update that I am going to give you. Um, I don't know if you'll notice on the screen, but the colors of the tank kind of seem different. And the reason for that is... Sorry if I blamed you. I have upgraded my Marineland LED double bright system and metal highlight to um, Cree LEDs. I have a total of 39. LEDs up there. Um, they are from Rapid LED and they are the plug and play system. As you can see, the little um, modules in the middle. Um, I am still using my two panorama, no, um, equally exotic stunner strips to give it a moonlight effect. But, um, uh, wow. Um, these LEDs rock. Like, seriously. Um, Shimmer is great, great color, and it's only been three days, and I'm starting to see a lot of growth, especially on, like, these bird's nests. Um, their little stalks coming out the bottom is great. Um, the reason for upgrading is because it's almost summer, and the highlight system, one, is actually generating a lot of heat, and two, is costing a lot out of my dad's electric bill, so I decided that might as well try to help out with a lot of stuff and now with the LEDs it won't the water won't evaporate that quickly and I won't have to refill it. So um yeah. Great colors. Um I did recently get a large Zoa rod for thirty bucks. Great deal, in my opinion. Um Dragon Eyes and Radioactive Dragon Eyes, I think. And some fruit loops over there. I don't know if you'll be able to see it, sorry for the dirty glass. But, um, yeah. So, just a little update. Um, rack with recent new, uh, new additions. Uh, purple people eaters, two of them right there. Kind of fragged the other off of the other. Um, candy apple red. Captain America, Pano cup, coral, kind of leaned over. I'll have to fix that. Um, Envy orange. A, um, the one though right there is a Paradise Convict Holly, um, JF Crazy Ladies, a unknown but red yet cool Zoas, and a frag of gold dusted polyps, and Bird's Nest, Pacillopora, Hydnophora frag, Sun Coral frags, Pulsating Xenia, and in the back over there is a Toadstool, which I need to fix since it's leaning over. Um, um, candy cane, doing great. Kind of loving the LEDs, kind of puffing up more. Green hydnophora, gonna have to move it from the sun coral, but great growth. Um, yeah, slow growing a little lately since I haven't dosed a little lately, so, oh well. Um, somehow there ended up to be one or two yellow polyps over here, and they start growing out ever since the LEDs, so... Great. Um, Zoa Rock, I just said. Green Star Polyps, growing on the other side now, or starting to grow on the other side. Green Acan, doing great. Um, a clone of the orange rose bubble tip anemone. Other clone being hosted by the maroon, female maroon clown. Um, in the little crevice over there, uh, some dragon eyes and the orange delight and a little radioactive green next to it that fell off the big rock. Um, dragon eyes, nothing too special. Um, uh, nuclear greens, uh, yeah. Uh, yellow polyps, one of the f clones of the larger rose bulb tip anemone. Radioactive greens, growing like mad over here. Red people eaters, star polyps, or star centered polyps, alien eyes, red, purple, acan, green people eater, gold dusted polyps, um, the two clones of the rose bulbs of anemone, other two clones, my like bad, doing well. SPS. Kind of dying in the middle. 
don't know if you'll notice that, but yeah, I don't know. Oh well. Uh, large green bubble tip anemone in the back. Um, sorry, I don't think you'll be able to see it. Hold on, let me try to check. Yeah, you won't be able to see it, but it's still doing well, growing. Um, what else? Kenya tree, doing great. Uh, green bubble tip anemone, first one, not doing too well. Um, yeah, the other rose bulb tip anemone kind of moved down here, probably because it didn't like the LEDs blinding itself, so probably moved down here. Uh, pulsating Xenia, not pulsating because of the water flow. Green mushrooms getting buried by the gravel. Um, I'm not to dig them out. Um, Acan Garden, doing great. New on the orange ones in the corner, two new baby polyps on the other side. It's great news. <laughs> um, torch coral, gold tip, brown torch coral, doing great. Green torch coral, wow. Yeah, my favorite coral on the sand bed right now. Pretty big too. Um, button polyps with some random polyps in the back. But, uh, yeah, that's the tank. Um, I know there are some people that are telling me that, yes, Sailfin, Naso, and a blue tank aren't, are too big for a small 70 gallon like this. Yes, I know. I will be upgrading to a, hopefully, 240 in the near future, around, in the middle of summer, around there, if I can afford one. <laughs> but, um, yeah, I will upgrade, so, please... Be aware of that. And, um, yeah. This is just an update video with the upgrade of the LEDs. Sorry if I blind you once again. Uh, 25 Royal Blues and, I believe, 24. Whoa, sorry. 24 Neutral Whites. So, Here's a quick full tank shot. Yeah. So, um, thank you for watching. Please rate, comment, subscribe, and um, stay tuned for other videos. Thanks.